Hi, this is Subhu, Rigging Artist and Programmer. In this video, I will show how to rig a bird through programming. This auto bird rigging script uses Cows as its base. Cows vertices stands for joint locations. Earlier, I have done this type of setup in Maya. In this video, I will explain some of the basic concepts in programming also like renaming, selection of the objects through programming and finding the joints locations from the curve vertices. Now I will create one curve. Let us take the path. Go to edit mode. This is the curve direction from left to right. This top vertex I am moving towards the hip area. This curve I am doing it for bird leg. After editing the curve, we can see these are the joint locations. This is for hip, this is for knee, this is for ankle and this is for foot. How this is going to apply in Blender, we can see roughly in Maya. This is the curve used for the leg joint setup. After running the script, we can see auto bird rigging panel was created here. We can drag and drop this panel to any location so that we can keep it on top. Let us hide these tools. Here we can see this is the character prefix. After rigging is done, complete setup is done, this prefix will be applied to complete hierarchy in the rig. If I switch on this character prefix, this prefix will be applied to all the joints and complete setup in this rig. Global scale is provided something like this. So, by using this global scale, we can scale this curve's complete group as per our requirement to suit various types of the birds any size and different types of necks like this. Here I have given control colors once the script is run this complete setup is created leg like setup. After drawing the spine setup curve, we can create spine setup also. This is information panel. In this we can see whatever the actions we are doing here, output will come here. This is the Python console. Here we can execute each line at a time. To start with panel programming, we need to import BPY module Blender Python. If we import all, star stands for all. 
from BPY every time we need not type this BPY. To find out the selected object, we'll use context. Most of the times we'll go for context in this auto rigging for the selection of various objects and finding out what are all the selected items. Though it is a bone, it is showing armature here. To get the bones, we should go for selected bones option. Now we can see armature 3 here. Easy bordering L hip joint. This is this easy board I have given as a prefix for all the joint setup here. If we don't want this prefixing in this we can switch off this prefix and we can run the setup again. Now we can see L hip joint, L knee joint, there is no prefixing. Now we'll check this same again. After changing the name, we can see L hip joint coming here. Even we can rename all these objects through programming. By pressing off arrow, we can select the last command. Now this name has been changed to new L hip joint. So we can see number of selected objects are 2. Now we can see number of selected objects are 3. Even this area also we can write through programming. Just by placing cursor here we can see scene dot char underscore prefix. Just by typing this, we can find out what is written here. Now if we go again up upside here, we can give name my bird. Just by pressing it up or down, it will be updated here. Now it is true. Whether this checkbox is, is checked or not, we can see here also. Now we can see whether this checkbox is checked it or not through programming. Yeah, we can see it here. Even we can apply this checkbox through this line. If we give equal sign, we can assign true or false here. 
or it will be updated here. can see here spine cow This is the local position. Now we will find out world position of this cow also so that we can get final position of this cow position in the world mode. we need only three parameters from this one this consists four parameters we need x y and z only so we need to define math from math utils import math utils as math This is the destination position for the vertex number 1. We will create one mesh. Let us scale it. we can see that cube location is at origin position. Now we will assign this destination position to this one. We can see cube is shifted to the first vertex in the scow. Similarly, we can snap joints. After creation of the joints, we can snap each and every location to the scow. So we can build complete hierarchy like this for complete board. Thanks for watching.